What's up everyone, Sick Eric Tech back with another video and today we're just going to be taking a look at a wireless lavalier microphone that I picked up off of Amazon for about $30. Uh, you can get this on a sale right now and this is by Bison and it is a wireless um, Bluetooth uh, microphone that you could plug in but you don't need Bluetooth to actually use it. So you don't need to connect it to your phone wirelessly with Bluetooth, you just plug it in. And they have a USB Type-C and a Lightning cable version. Uh, and it comes out to about $30. You can get 24% off right now off of Amazon. And um, I really wanted to check out something like this to uh, sort of break away from wires as far as connecting everything to a smartphone. And you're supposed to get pretty good quality out of this. Uh, CD audio quality on here. And about two hours of charge time gives you about four to six hours of usage. So that is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and check it out. And then we're going to play some footage for you with the microphone. Now we can hear a difference in the microphone and the audio quality right now. Uh, to do this video, I'm using the LG V60 with no external microphone connected. So the V60, this is what you're hearing from it. Nothing else, nothing more. And then we're going to try it out with it. Now, this does work with the Galaxy S22 Ultra. Uh, it will not work with the OnePlus just because it does not support external microphones. And it does work on the V60. So let's go ahead and check out the diagram as far as the uh, instructions go. So pretty plain and simple. You just turn it on and you plug in the other side. And that's pretty much it. So here is the lavalier microphone right here. And it comes with a little uh, foam protector on there as well. And the power button, you just pretty much click and hold that to turn it on and the light will turn. Uh, it'll flash red and green. And once it's connected, it'll be green. And the uh, lavalier clip right here, I kind of wish it was vertical rather than uh, like this. That way you could sort of hook it on your shirt upright like so. And this is the part that you plug into your phone. This is USB Type-C, pretty simple, uh, pretty easy to use. Over here, let's see what comes in this box. Uh, looks like we get a dead cat for outside wind noise, so that's pretty nice right there. Maybe we'll try to check that out. The one day that it is not windy, I need to, I need it to be windy. Every day I've been doing a video, it's been windy as hell. And you get your USB A to USB Type C charging cable. All right, so very, very cool. And the dead cat, if it's windy outside, I might try that out. Let's go ahead and put all that aside. And uh, let's go ahead and give this microphone a test. Here are some specs. It is by Bison. Uh, pretty simple, pretty easy to do. Plug and play. You get about two meters of reception, so that's pretty cool. Uh, the audio apparently is really good, so I'm excited to test that out and see how it is as far as picking up background noise. We'll go ahead and test it out, and you can get it in Type C or for iPhone Lightning cable. And then there are there is coming a, a two pack that you could get off of Amazon. So if you want to do interviews and stuff like that, so I wanted to try to check out something. If you like vlogging or doing interviews or live shows, this might be it for you. So let's go ahead and check out some audio coming from this. We'll plug it in, and then we'll play the difference as far as uh, with it plugged in and with the uh, phone audio. All right, so this is uh, audio coming from the LG V60 right here. No external microphone connected, but I want you to get an idea of the background noise as far as the AC vents and stuff like that and other ambient noises in here and uh, let you guys hear exactly how the V60 picks up noises. And then we're going to try out the microphone and show you guys the differences. All right, now we got the microphone set up right here on my shirt. And uh, let me know, does it sound any better or does it sound any worse? I'm holding the V60 uh, a little bit further away from me as far as I can reach. That way you guys can get an idea of the audio quality and the background noise. Can you hear any of it? Now, it's supposed to have some sort of noise cancellation on here. 
to uh, block out some ambient noises and the background noise and just pick up my voice. So I want to see exactly how that works and if it's working on here. So let me know how the audio is compared without a microphone uh, compared to with it on. Does it sound any better? Is it distorting? Can you hear any of the background noise? Or not? All right, so let's go outside and see if there's any wind, shall we? All right, so here we are outside and there is a little bit of a breeze, but not much. But I went ahead and put the deck hat on just to see exactly how it sounds and if it's helping or if it helps any as far as uh, blocking out some wind. It's not windy today. The day I wish it was windy, it is not windy, but I feel a little bit of a breeze. So let's go ahead and see if we could hear a difference or if this deck hat is working and how it sounds outdoors as far as just picking up my sound and nothing else, just my voice. So yeah, here it is. And let's go ahead and go back and uh, see if we can hear a difference as far as the audio quality goes. All right, let's continue, shall we? All right, so what do you guys think of the audio quality of this little guy right here, this little uh, wireless lavalier microphone? Um, upon reviewing the footage, I think it sounded pretty good. A lot better than uh, the microphones on a phone as far as picking up background noise. So uh, here it is on how to connect it. You pretty much just plug it into the bottom, like so, onto your device. And when you turn it on, you're going to know it is connected with that green light. If you disconnect the bottom, it's going to flash red and green. But once it's turned on and once it's plugged in, it'll be a solid green on there. And then it will fully pick up the um, your audio on here. So if you were to press record, you can see recording audio through USB mic and you'll know it's working. So very, very nice. You get a charging port on the side, USB type C. So that's pretty cool. No micro USB. So it is pretty up to date as far as that goes. Uh, two hours of charging time will give you four to six hours. Uh, you get a a pretty good range as far as uh, about 60 feet to where you could record on this until it starts breaking up but uh, you don't need any apps or anything to run this so that is pretty cool it's very easy to use and um, the only thing I wish this had was a uh, let's go ahead and turn it off was the the uh, clip right here to be vertical I wish it was facing this way rather than this way that way you could hook it onto your shirt or a little clip, uh, a little slider clip would have been nice on there too. That way you could hook it like that because like this, it is a little weird to uh, just clip it onto your shirt. But it's, I think it sounds pretty good. Let me know how this little guy sounds in the comments down below. So thank you guys for watching. This has been a little review of the Bison Wireless uh, Lavalier Microphone. I'll post a link in the description if you guys want to check this out. If you do a lot of vlogging or if you're on a YouTube and you want to get a little bit better audio on your channel, check this out. It might work for you. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.